Hello Virgo, welcome to my channel Imrama Tarot. My name is Dipali. I'm a tarot card reader. I'm also a Reiki healer, a crystal healer and a manifestation coach. Let's see what the universe has for you. So this reading is for new moon which is um, on 19th May in the sign of Taurus this time. Also it's a general reading guys so please take what resonates and leave what does not. You do not have to forcefully fit everything in your life here. Okay. Let's see. Virgo, Taurus, New Moon, 19th May. First quarter moon in Scorpio, release your blocks. Virgo. Uh, okay, so the first card is about releasing your block. Um, I feel Virgo, it's, it's very um, like it's a very clear and a direct message from the universe. You need to release your blocks. Now, these blocks are related to your sacral chakra, okay? Um, you are either not confident about being physically intimate with someone and you are very insecure when it comes to um, this whole process of getting physically involved or you are not confident about your body if not uh, these things then um, maybe you need to get yourself tested because that because I'm, I'm feeling there could be other blockages in your reproductive system in your private parts male female uh, but please get yourself checked guys there is definitely um, a blockage it could be an emotional blockage or it could be a physical block in your reproductive system but uh, yes you need to you need to release these blocks get rid of them get yourself tested work on them if this is not uh, like a physical ailment sort of a thing if this is more uh, towards emotions and your confidence and everything then I feel you need to work on your uh, sacral chakra by um, with the help of some crystals you can ask your healer to to give you certain crystals for your sacral chakra and charge them in with intentions okay they work like magic in a very very positive way but get rid of these blockages guys Virgo new moon in Taurus 19th May new moon in Sagittarius focus on the positive Virgo I feel um, this is universe's indication that you need to focus uh, more on the positive sides maybe you are focusing on the negative things here and you have not been um, you have been thinking uh, of how things could go wrong or how things have not been good in the past maybe you have been focusing a lot on the negative parts here i feel there is going to be a new opportunity uh, coming towards you or like a new beginning or a new opportunity or some something in in the in the shape of a positive beginning okay and universe is uh, is is indicating that you are getting a new chance to build things from scratch so please be positive about it don't don't start with your negative thinking and you know those kind of things yes first quarter moon in Taurus release control wow hmm Taurus there are um, why did I say Taurus Virgo there are a couple of blockages your we can see there um, there is a blockage in your sacral chakra we can also see that there is a blockage in your root chakra as well okay um, you can get help um, you can use red jasper it works wonders i have been wearing one in my um, as an anklet I've been wearing this as an anklet it's red jasper I don't know if you can see this yes but uh, it works for uh, root chakra um, unblocking but um, guys you need to uh, release control I feel you are um, you are too much in control of the situation and uh, what needs to be done and how needs to be done and uh, how things are happening you are just not going with the flow you are too much in control you are restricting the flow of the universe you are restricting the flow and you know like the natural flow release control release control of how things are going to be 
release control of what happened in the past root chakra is about your base root chakra talks about your base your childhood your past traumas your if if your foundation was strong enough or not that is what root chakra focuses on release control if you think that uh, your past is not good or has been very traumatic and that is why you have been um, you know you haven't been able to heal from it release release while you are holding your past you are also trying to control universe's way of healing you because universe has designed a certain path for you but you are stuck in a situation and you are carrying your past in your future so you are obstructing universe's way don't do that release control release okay release control guys virgo virgo leave the past behind last quarter moon in capricorn virgo i just said this i just now told you this you need to leave your past you're carrying your past in your present and your future which is becoming a burden and it is slowing you down and it is acting as an obstacle as an obstruction in universe's way you you cannot do that please don't do that okay leave the past behind release the past forgive release there are so many releases virgo release control leave the past behind release your blocks focus on the positive i feel you you are very <laughs> you are very skeptical when it comes to good things you feel that good thing is happening with me na because you are used to unhealthy patterns and that is why whenever a good thing comes towards you you feel na this is not for me you know i'm used to that certain kind of pattern i want to go back to that and you go back to that pattern and that is where you obstruct universe's way universe's um idea and plan you obstruct the universe's plan Virgo new moon in Taurus Virgo new moon in Taurus Virgo new moon in Taurus 19th May First quarter moon in Capricorn unleash your kindest self Okay Virgo there is another blockage okay <laughs> Please um you know go go have a word have a discussion with a healer um you could you could take some reiki sessions you could get some crystals i have already told you what works in case of sacral chakra and then in case of root chakra now there is blockage in the solar plexus as well there is lack of confidence there is lack of self love there is lack of self worth um there is um there is lack of you know like drawing boundaries maybe some of you are also going through some kind of acne problem or indigestion constipation but uh, yeah your your solar plexus chakra is blocked and you need to um universe is asking you to please you have been because of your because of you carrying your past you have become this dry person okay and uh, somewhere you feel that being emotional is a waste of time and you have become very dry and very like straight to the point i won't call you rude but very straight to the point and dry and not very um not very kind towards your own self and towards others um but um, universe here is asking you to please unleash unleash your kindest self towards others yes but towards your own self as well i feel you have been punishing yourself by not taking care of yourself by not um you know focusing on what you are feeling how you are feeling 
you are, i think there is definitely some kind of blockage in your heart chakra as well because see three major chakras are blocked virgo three major chakras are blocked and you know with chakras what happens is uh, if your sacral chakra is blocked and your solar plexus is also blocked then oh all the three lower chakras are blocked that's not that, that's not good that's not good your root chakra your sacral chakra your solar plexus chakra is blocked um definitely your heart chakra is also blocked and you know what happens when two chakras let's say a crown chakra and a throat chakra is blocked third eye chakra is bound to be blocked because it's it falls in between the two blocked chakras it is definitely blocked and that is why solar plexus the next comes heart chakra it is definitely blocked in your case you do not accept when uh, when someone is giving you love you find it little you know like why is it happening and you you don't you find it weird to receive love and accept love yes please please work on yourself virgos get rid of these insecurities these blockages crystals reiki meditation mindfulness practices whatever works for you please do this okay it's high time so that is all that i have for you virgo let me know if you like my readings in case you did hit the like button comment share also um if you resonate with all of my readings and if you like how i do my work then please subscribe to my channel imrama taro i'm trying to build my channel here and i really need your support because i love what i do so you can support me in the form of subscription or donation whatever is convenient for you guys okay so yeah that is all be kind stay happy see you next time bye